Space is a vast, uncompromising place that's innately hostile to human life. Leaving the face of the planet to explore space was one of the defining pursuits of the 20th century, as few brave humans strapped themselves into powerful contrivances to climb against the forces of gravity. Of course, the logistics of sending a person into space require extreme precision and balancing. Everything needed to sustain and protect human life must be packed on board, and every ounce is accounted for as weight and space are extremely limited. So if I told you that Russian cosmonauts carried a gun with them to space, what would you think they needed one for? Aliens which have been kept secret from the public? Gunfights on board the International Space Station. It turns out the answer is much more mundane, but no less threatening. What leaves the Earth must return eventually, and in the case of those on Russian space missions, that return to Earth often left them in vast wilderness, isolated potentially for weeks until they could be retrieved. Priorities for that time would include shelter, food, and defense from the area's natural predators. Enter today's topic, the Trustvulnia Pistolet Vulsum Dava, Triple Barreled Pistol 82. Colloquially known as the Pistolet Cosmonavta, or in English, the Cosmonaut Pistol. Please do forgive my Russian, by the way, it's not my strongest language. Designed to allow for game gathering for food as well as to defend against large animals, the TP-82 is a veritable multi-tool of survival weaponry. The pistol uses a brake barrel action with three independent barrels, two shotgun barrels and one rifle barrel. The rifle barrel is chambered in 545 by 39 mm a standard issue rifle caliber used in firearms such as the AK-74. The two shotgun barrels are chambered in a proprietary 12.5mm shot shell cartridge. For those familiar with other shotguns, this is equivalent to roughly a 40 gauge. This would place its power at less than a 28 gauge, but more than a 410 shot shell. These were issued with not only hunting rounds for the shotgun, but signal flares which would help locate grounded crew members. This combination gun arrangement may seem unusual, but it's not the first kind to have been used as a survival weapon. German gunmaker J.P. Sauer manufactured a three-barrel rifle, commonly known as a dryling or drilling. These featured two 12-gauge barrels, one left unconstricted for shooting slugs and the other choked for shot, and a 9.3 by 74 mm rimmed rifle barrel. During World War II, Nearly 2,500 of these rifles were procured for use as a survival weapon by Luftwaffe pilots, primarily those flying over North Africa. Although the TP-82 is a pistol by design, it does have a stabilizing stock attachment that could be used to steady aim and take longer, more accurate shots. The stock is incredibly compact and being detachable means that it can be stored in a relatively small container. But it has yet another secret trick. The stock is actually an assembly made of a machete and sheath, which itself can be used as a survival tool. The TP-82 was issued from 1986 to 2007. During this time, it was reportedly stocked as a standard item in the emergency kit on spacecraft in the Soyuz space program. In 2007, it was announced that the proprietary shot cartridge produced for the gun had passed their storage life and the gun was phased out rather than manufacture now obsolete cartridges. It's unclear if any of the guns were ever used substantially as intended, or whether they remained just another part of an emergency kit which accompanied people to space. Regardless, it's now another entry in our strange and storied history. The triple-barreled pistol shotgun with a machete stock that was carried by spacemen.